there's one thing you can ask for a scientist, what would you ask? I would like to know how cows kiss. How cows kiss? <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Robert. Hi. Hi Robert. And you're looking forward to learn some science today? Yes. Yeah. I'm actually a physicist and I'm working at the institute where also Albert Einstein worked. Cool. That's cool, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Uh, today I want to talk about something that we see everywhere around us. Color. Do you have any idea what color is? Color is like um, something to show something else, like personality. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It's like pink, blue, yellow, mm -hmm. orange. Yes, there are lots of colors. But what is color? And how do you make color? Um, you, you just... I don't know. Where does it come from? you have any idea where color comes from? Nature. It comes from nature, yes. Science? Science, yeah. yes, a little the bit. The universe. From the universe. You know, I have kind of a, a secret for you to share. You know, light contains all the colors. Like a rainbow. It's yeah. Like a rainbow. Is it difficult to make a rainbow? Yeah. Shall we do it? Shall we make a rainbow? Yeah. Yeah. You know, there's a very simple way you can do it. Now, this is a, a CD. And, you know, it doesn't really have a color, but just look at it. What do you see? Choose a rainbow. But you see the white light coming from the lamps. They, they produce all these different colors. So all the different colors are already hidden in the white light. So I think we should do an experiment now. Are you ready for an experiment? Yeah. Yeah, okay, let's do an experiment. Experiment one. Okay, kids, so now we're gonna try to understand what light is. And the first thing you should know that light is actually a wave. And one way to see that is if you look through your, through your eyelashes and it's squinting, look at it. Can you see like stripes? Very close. I see it. You see kind of little patterns, like little ripples, like the waves on the like, pond. What do you like see? Like a... Yeah. I just see little fuzzy lines. Fuzzy, yeah. Uh, so the thing is that light is a wave and it's produced by the molecules, like in your shirt or in anything. And if they vibrate slowly, like I'm doing right now, and I'm just pretending to be a molecule, it produces a wave which is kind of a long, slow wave. You see it? It's a long wave. And if I'm a fast molecule, see what happens. <laughs> you have very short waves. So I want both of you, now you be the slow molecule. Can you do that? Just try it. Move slowly. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Oh, beautiful. And you be the fast molecule. You can move a little bit faster. Okay, go. So you see, you're now you're molecules and you're producing light. So what do you think if you have a color in between, like orange or green? What would it be, a short or a long wave? It would be like in the middle. In the middle, yeah, exactly. In the medium, it would go. So if you look at the rainbow and you see all the different colors, you're actually looking at the shape of the light. So you guys, are you hungry? Would it be time for a snack? Yeah. Snack time! Yeah. Mm. <laughs> so guys, what? Um, tell me something that you uh, that you learned recently. Something that I don't know. Um, I know how to make robots. You know how to make robots? Mm -hmm. Oh wow! <laughs> Do you know how to make a robot? Mm, yes and no. If you would have a robot, what would you use it for? I would use it to do my chores, so that instead of me, instead of me doing my chores and getting money, I would be relaxing and getting money for relaxing. Wow. You think if you go to the future that there will be lots of robots? Yeah. You think there will be... Uh, servants? Servants, or you will be the servant to the robot? Oh, I'm not going to be a servant to the robot. So guys, if there's one thing you can ask for a scientist, what would you ask? What's really the question you would like to see answered? Are you single? Are you single? <laughs> That's funny. I also have a question. My question is, why is the sky blue? And I want to do an experiment to show it. You like to do an experiment? Another one? Yeah! yeah. Experiment 2! 
Okay, kids, so we are gonna see why the sky is blue. And why do you think that the sky is blue? Oh. So we can see, and so the sun has enough light to show everywhere. But why blue? Why not green or red? You know, the thing is, we can actually kind of try to uh, make a little piece of, of air. And instead of air, I have something else here, which is water. But water actually is also blue, right? Actually, to do the experiment, I'm adding a little bit more molecules. So what I'm doing, I'm adding a little bit of milk here. Peter? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. That's so cool. Yeah. So we created like very thick air. Yeah. Here, you get a flashlight. You can be the sun and try it. So we have now five suns. If we shine it here, um, it looks blue on top. Wow, it's really blue. You see this? Yeah. So look on that side. Look at what color my flashlight has. Can you see it? It's orange. I'm going to see mine. Mine's orange too. So we made a sunset. I'm going to see mine. So that's how sunset Mine too. Yeah. yeah. You see the blue is, uh, is scattered okay. and the the color that goes through all the way is the orange one. And if you think about it, it does make sense because what are the blue light? The blue light is very small. So suppose you take your, on your bicycle and you hit a tree, what happens? You fall. You fall. Now suppose you're in a big truck and you hit a tree, what happens? You just go through, right? You just go right through. So the blue light is small and it hits the molecules and it bounces off. But the red light is very big and it just goes through. Yeah. Well, thank you for being such great scientists. You know, you did a terrific experiment. I think we learned a lot. And let's create a little bit more blue sky. Okay, thank you guys. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Uh, I learned. We learned how to um how, how one tiny light can spread around the whole universe and one tiny white light can contain every single color we, we did a rope thing and red is slow and the blue one goes super super fast we had milk and flashlights and water. He used a lot of scientific words. Sometimes people don't know that you're learning, but you actually are. He's very smart. No offense, but I think maybe more than you. <laughs>